In this visualization, Sirium's fleet data displays the historical race between the Airbus A320 and Boeing 737 families. The Boeing 737-100 and slightly larger Dash 200 entered service in the late 1960s and both were powered by the Pratt & Whitney JT-8D engine. In the mid-1980s, Boeing decided to re-engine the 737 with the high bypass ratio CFM-56 and the resulting 737-300 rapidly gained popularity. It was joined by a stretched version, the 737-400. Towards the end of the 1980s, Airbus entered the market with the A320-100, and then the much more popular Dash 200, rapidly gaining a foothold in the market. Airbus also introduced a stretched version, the A321, and a smaller version, the A319. In an effort to preserve its market position, Boeing opted to re-engine the 737 once again, this time with the CFM 56-7. The resulting 737-700 next generation was joined by the stretched 737-800, which rapidly became the most popular model in the family. The A320 had by this point established itself as the most widely used single aisle twin jet in service. However, the 737-800 eventually managed to overtake it. As we reached the end of the 2010s, both manufacturers decided to re-engine their families once again. First of all Airbus with the A320neo and then Boeing with the 737 MAX. The race will no doubt continue into the next decade and Sirium's team of experts will continue to be the primary source of aviation data and analytics. Interact with this visualisation and more at Sirium.com.